But when I tried to explain like why a negative number times a negative number meant a positive, I was like, I don't have, I don't have a conceptual piece to make this make sense to you because I didn't want to pass on to him to just this memorization technique because I was aware of my forgettability. And I was like, I think this kid's going to forget it too. So I need something to make it make sense. And, and I think maybe it was that it was the, the desire for something to stick. Like I wanted to be able to use it later and I didn't, maybe I just didn't trust uh, my memory to, <laughs> to pull it back out again the next year and have it if I was just memorizing. But I felt like if I could, if I had some reasoning behind it, then I could use it again later on when I needed it. And I don't even know why I thought I would need it later. Um, I wasn't planning on being a math major in college. I was, I did turn out to be, but um, for some reason I had this, this notion that I just, I wanted something that would stick.